Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to create a loading or buffering circle with a program percentage like this. At first create a new composition and name it loading point. It's important to set the FPS to 30, otherwise you have to calculate. With double clicking on the ellipse tool you create a perfect circle. Press S on the keyboard to open the scale menu and scale the circle down to 10%. Open the Transform sub-menu and change the Y-coordinate from the anchor point to 4000. Press R on the keyboard and create a keyframe. Go to the end of the composition and set rotation to one full rotation. Mark the keyframes and press F9 on the keyboard to make the animation less static. Search in the effect panel for the echo effect and drag the effect on the shape layer. Set the echo time to minus 0.07 or let's set it to minus 0.06. That looks good. Set the number of echoes to 4. Go to the end of the composition and drag keyframes towards the end till you only see one circle. To loop this animation, create a new composition, which is for example 10 seconds long. Drag the footage in this new composition. Right click, time, enable time remapping. Now while holding down the alt key, click the stopwatch and type in loop out, open bracket, quotation mark, cycle, quotation mark, comma, zero, close bracket. Now you can extend the composition how long as you want. To create the percentage, create a new text layer and type in 100%. Now open the source text submenu and while holding down the alt key, click the stopwatch. Type in math with a big M, point, round, open bracket, time multiplied, open bracket, 10 divided 1, close bracket, close bracket, plus, quotation mark, percent, quotation mark. If you want to make this animation longer or shorter, you have to divide your composition length by 10 and change the one in this code with your result. But this only works when you work with 30 FPS. To center the text, go to layer, transform, center anchor point in the layer content and go to the align panel. If you don't have this panel, go to window and activate it. Now align the text layer and the animation is done. You can use time remapping for every animation to loop, for example for this loading circle. For this animation I use the trim path tool. If you want that I also produce a tutorial about it, just write it in the comments. So I hope you enjoyed this video and we see us in the next. Bye!